Faria before passing judgment on any wrongdoing in the judiciary. Without a legal proof necessary to support the opinion in this column, a columnist stands to lose when asked to account for his writings in a contempt charges. The reports of rest cannot be due to attain some sort of finality, unlike the judgment of the court. The even press time, an article cannot claim their final word. The trade allows them to post follow-up stories, note an erratum, and feature the perspective and respective size of two concerned parties in separate consecutive issues or relations. In short, the coverage is continuous. Indeed, the granules of truth do not turn up in a single grain form. The heartbringers are either size seize it or allow it to evaporate. Considering the peculiarities of the journalism profession, profession, it has been said that journalism is the first rough draft of history. In that situation, it seems to impart the message that journalism cannot afford to be a mere rough draft when it covers matters relating to their reputation of the judiciary. Benjamin Franklin once stated that if all printers were determined not to print anything until they were sure it would offend nobody, there would be very little printing. Parenthetically, if all printers were determined not to print anything until they are very sure it could convey only words of truth, there would be little discovery. History tells us that modern made truths and breakthrough exposés were considered heresies and blasphemies at their inception until after they were constantly challenged and instilled in the agora of ideas where sacred beliefs and sacrilegious opinions clash to produce that spark of enlightenment. I thus summon even challenge you, members of the press, to continue emitting that spark. Thank you and my boy.
shameful Philippines, of the fearless press, of the fearless, free Philippine press. And at this point, we will call on the surviving members of the Yambot family, uh, Mildred Yambot, if she's here, and the uh, brothers Yanni, Ephraim, June, and Ruben, to come up on stage. And we call on Boss Jake and the trustees of the Big Five.